cut this stuff up at home and save some money. I've been getting a lot of these comments lately. People are wanting me to do bigger chunks of meat and different ones so they can cut it up themselves at their house. Right here, I have a top sirloin. This was actually just from a local grocery store. They had them on sale. So I asked the butcher, hey, can I get a whole one in the cryovac? And he sold it to me, a little bit cheaper than their sale price, just because they didn't have to do anything to it. Now I could take it home and break it down myself, get the picanha right here. I can get that fat, I can save it. These little scraps of beef, I can save to grind, or I can spread it out and make some fajita. Whatever I wanna make, I can make. This is a really good way to do it. Normally, if you buy a top sirloin at the store, they're gonna run you about 10 bucks a pound nowadays. This guy was about $4 a pound. Nothing's going to waste. This beef tallow on the shelf rendered down is going for about 10 bucks a jar. So any way you look at it, I'm saving. And let's just say I fucked this whole entire thing up. Guess what? I can just grind it. I can make hamburger and still get $4 a pound hamburger. And if you don't have a grinder, fuck it. You don't have to use a grinder, use a food processor. And if you don't wanna do anything like that, throw the whole thing into a crock pot and shred it up. You're still getting really quality meat for about $4 a pound. Follow the instructions, follow the video. This is how we cut up the top sirloin. We got a lot of food now, baby. We're not wasting any money and we're gonna keep this ball rolling.